Well, and you figure they bought the house for a hundred thousand dollars, you know, 30 years ago or whatever, 40 years ago. Yeah. And now they're sitting on a million dollar house. I greatly believe that we are going to see a lot of generational shifting of equity. And what do I mean by that? I mean, there's going to be a lot of parents that are gifting some money to their children and grandchildren in order to be able to get into the real estate market. And I think we're going to see a lot of that over the next five to 10 years. Well, especially because the um, parents don't, I mean, a lot of parents will want their kids to be closer and it's not, and, and a lot of parents live in the GTA and they don't want their kids moving to Cambridge, Kitchener, Waterloo, um, Woodstock, Stony Creek, whatever. They want them to be within a reasonable driving distance, especially if there's potential for grandkids. So, you know, why wouldn't they give them some of that potential inheritance up early? Well, and you uh, figure they bought the house for $100,000, you know, 30 years ago or whatever, 40 years ago. Yeah. And now they're sitting on a million dollar house with all this equity. And now they realize, well, we don't need this house. It's too big for us. We're retired now. We need to downsize. We can't, we don't want stairs. We don't want much maintenance. So they buy a $500,000 condo. They've already got their nest egg and now they've got another half a million bucks. So instead of, you know, waiting until they're dead to pass that money along, they're going to give it out to to kids and to grandkids. And that's what's happening already. And it's going to happen more and more. And that's what's going to invigorate the lower price properties. And then the higher price properties are going to see a lot of just move up buyers. Again, you've built up the equity in your existing home, your home and your, your family is growing. You need some more space. You want that main floor office that you can't get in X square footage. So you say, now we need X plus one and you're going to move up. So there's going to be lots of movement at all prices of, uh, of the resale ladder. 